Hey, Dada. Hey, what's up, Papa? What happens if they amputate they le their leg? Someone's leg, yeah. So if you have a leg amputation, that means that they cut it off, right? And so there's two types. There's below the knee amputation or BKA and above the knee or AKA amputations, right? The idea is this. The patient's going to come back from surgery. Any surgical procedure within the first 48 hours, the most common complication outside of airway issues is going to be bleeding. So you look for indications of bleeding, um, fatty emboli and things like that. But then you're looking for 72 hours or more infection, right? But what's really important is the post-op considerations for a patient with uh, an amputation is that for the first 24 to 48 hours, the patient's residual limb is going to be elevated so the edema can subside. After that, you want to make sure that you place the patient in a prone position several times throughout the day so they can turn around and they can flex and extend that residual limb or the stump so the muscles and nerves can become stretched out and so there's no contractures that are occurring. You want to look at the incision site to ensure that there's no dehiscence, meaning it's uh, um, an um, impromptu like opening that you don't want it to happen. So you have to look for all those particular things, look at the vital signs, look for hypotension, tachycardia, any indications of actual bleeding. And um, that's what's happening with uh, below the knee or the above the knee amputation. One more thing though, when people have an amputation, you have to make sure that you put a, pro if they're gonna be using a prosthetic or a prosthesis, which they're probably gonna use, um, you have to get it fitted in really quick uh, shortly after the surgery because you want the residual limb to start being molded adequately. So you have to wrap it um, so and make it really snug so it can form like a teardrop, so it can fit into the um, into the uh, prosthetic cavity in order for the patient to be able to utilize it the best. Thanks, Dada. Mm -hmm.